making water spheres. Up till now, we've been looking at sheet two-dimensional geometry, and now we're moving to three-dimensional spherical geometry, and we're going to show three ways to make a sphere attached to a loop. First, we start off with a standard water sheet, and we just add more water to it and puff it up into a full sphere, as you are seeing here. All these spheres are made with the 50 millimeter diameter loop. Second method is to just add water to the loop until the sphere bloats up and touches the loop all the way around and gets locked in on its diameter cord. And until that happens, it's rather precarious. It's really easy to lose this sphere of water. And watch what happens now as it gets larger and larger, and eventually it gets locked in by the diameter hoop, and then it's going to stay put. And once you have this water sphere locked in, you can move it all around and do all kinds of other things with it. Here we're going to just lasso a free sphere of water with the loop. You can draw some of the water off with a towel and you will end up with a non-spherical shaped object like you see here in profile. I guess you could call this magnifier a meniscus lens.